सदाशिवसमारंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा वसुदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा श्रुतिश्रुति पुराणा आलिंग करुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकर लोकशंकर शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादराण सूत्र भाष्यकृत वंदे भगवत पुनः पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मेति मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योमवद्व्याप्तिदेहा दक्षिणामूर्त नम ओं सहनावत सहनौ नक्त सह वीर करवाहै तेजस्वीनावधीतमस्तुमाशावे ओं शातिशाशाति ओं यो ब्रह्मांडातिपुरुदाश्च प्रणोति तस्म तगुम हेमात्मबुद्धि प्रकाश मुक्शुरो शरणमहम प्रपद्ये ओं शातिशाशाति कामनायां देव संसिध्यमाधिमध्यानंदघनमापूर्णमात्मज्योतिपास्मे The eighth sutra has no sangati, <coughs> so the sangati for the earlier sutra was even purva paksha radhanta. The siddhanta after the purva paksha sutra, meaning anyathatum shabdadit che na vishesha atha. There purva paksha had said that because of the uh, differences shabdat, because of the shabda, if there is difference in this particular prana or the udgita vidya so the udgita vidya really it is udgita vidya because in even in prana udgita gata or meaning udgita karta gana karta or udgita itself these are the upasanas taught across shakhas they in this particular case they have to be seen as different and since udgita is being seen udgita buddhi is seen in prana it is udgita vidya so in udgita vidya there is this particular udgita vidya there is bheda because the swarupa itself is different across shakhas this was the claim made by the purva pakshi that was taken as a as an objection by the purva pakshi and uh, the siddhanti had made this claim purva pakshi took this as an objection and he says that Uh, no why avishesha there is there is avishesha there are there is no specific difference between the two and then in the seventh sutra siddhanti showed this swarupa bheda in the udgita vidya across the two shakhas now in continuation sanyataschet uktam asti tu tarapi sanyataschet uktam asti tu tarapi so idi purva pakshi से संयाता चेत तद उक्तम अस्ति तु तद अपि दैट इज अ पद छेद संयाता मींस द संज्ञा बीइंग सेम इन बोथ द शाखास उद्गीत विद्या इज द संज्ञा गिवन टू बोथ विद्यास सो देयर नीड नॉट बी टू डिफरेंट विद्यास बिकॉज़ ऑफ द नेम बीइंग सेम this we have handled earlier also siddhanti says and the differences are not allowing the sanya to make the upasana same across both shakhas there are too many differences so rupa is different <coughs> so upasana cannot be clubbed together you cannot have because the name is same udgita vidya across both shakhas just because of that reason you cannot club together gunas into a single upasana because you cannot have udgita gana karta as udgita itself by clubbing together contradictory gunas of two shakhas you cannot make it a single upasana it is logically not possible to have an upasana where you say that prana is singing udgita and he is the udgita makes no sense therefore sanyatah chit even if you say it is named so udgita is the name given and both the upasanas across both shakas are named so iti chit even if that is the sanyatas chit tad uktam asti that has already been answered to tadapi it has also that particular thing is also it has been answered So we'll see what is the meaning where it is answered in the vritti. It is a short vritti. 
ಕೃಷ್ಣನು ಉದ್ಗೀತ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಇದು ಉಭಯತ್ರ ಸಂಜಾತ ಉಭಯತ್ರ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ಬೋತ್ ವಾಜಸನೀಯ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಛಾಂದೋಗ್ಯ ಶಾಖ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾ ಗಿವನ್ ನೇಮ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಟು ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಉದ್ಗೀತ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಡೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾಯ ಏಕತ್ವಾತ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ದಿ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾ ದಿ ನೇಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ದೇರ್ ಫೋರ್ ವಿದ್ಯೈಕ್ಯಂ ದುಪಾಸನ ಶುಡ್ ಬಿ ಒನ್ ಇತಿ ಚೇತ್ ಇಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಜಸ್ಟಿಫಿಕೇಶನ್ ಗಿವನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಬೋತ್ ದಿ ಉದ್ಗೀತ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಅಕ್ರಾಸ್ ಶಾಖಾಸ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಒನ್ ಇಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಕ್ಲೇಮ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಬೈ ದಿ ಪೂರ್ವಪಕ್ಷಿ ತರುಕ್ತ ದಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ಡ್ ನವ ಆ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಭೇದ ಇತಿ ಸೂತ್ರ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಸೂತ್ರ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಎಲ್ ವಿ ಹವ್ ಸೆಡ್ ದಟ್ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಭೇದ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಯು ಕೆ ನಾಟ್ ಕ್ಲಬ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಒನ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ ಪ್ರಮಾಣ ಟು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಏಕವಾಕ್ಯತ ಬಟ್ ಪ್ರಕರಣ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಯು ಕೆ ನಾಟ್ ಬ್ರಿಂಗ್ ಏಕವಾಕ್ಯತ ಇತಿ ಸೂತ್ರ ದೇರ್ ಹೆಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಸೆಟ್ ಸೊ ತದುಕ್ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಆನ್ಸರ್ಡ್ ಅಸ್ತಿ ತು ತತ್ ಅಸ್ತಿ ತು ತದಿ ಸಂಜೈಕತ್ವ ಎಸ್ ಅಸ್ತಿ ತು ತಬ್ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾ ಏಕತ್ವ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಇನ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಸೊ ಅಸ್ತಿ ತು ತದಿ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಂಜ್ಞಾ ತದ್ ತದ್ ಅಪಿ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ತದ್ ಸಂಜೈಕ ಸಂಜೈಕ್ಯಂ ಆರ್ ಸಂಜಾತ ಸಂಜಾತ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಸಂಜಾ ಏಕತ್ವ ಆರ್ ಸಂಜೈಕ್ಯಂ ಸೊ ಸಂಜೈಕ್ಯಂ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ತದ್ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ನೆಸ್ ಆಫ್ ನೇಮ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ ಅಪಿ ತು ಹವೆವರ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಅ ತು ಹವೆವರ್ ತದ್ ಸಂಜೈಕ್ಯಂ ಅಪಿ ಈವನ್ ದಟ್ ಸಂಜೈಕ್ಯಂ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಅಸ್ತಿ ವೇರ್ ಇನ್ ಕರ್ಮಕಾಂಡ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ನಾಟ್ ಇನ್ ಉಪಾಸನಾಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಕರ್ಮ ಸೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸಂಜಾ ಇಸ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಬಟ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಅಕ್ರಾಸ್ ಶಾಖಾಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ವೃತ್ತಿ ಇಂದಿ ವೃತ್ತಿ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಸದಾಶಿವರಂ ಸೇ ಸಂಜೈಕತ್ವ ಪ್ರಸಿದ್ಧ ಭೇದಿ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಪ್ರವೃತ್ತಿ ಕಾಠಕ ಕಾಠಕೈಕ ಗ್ರಂಥ ಪಠಿತ ಕಾಠಕತ್ವ ಸಂಜೈಕತ್ವ ಸೊ ಈಗ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಯು ಲುಕ್ ಅಟ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಶಾಖ ಇನ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಶಾಖ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಇತ್ಯಾದಿ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ ಕರ್ಮ ಬಟ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಶ್ರುತಿ ಕಾಠಕ ಶಾಖ ಕಟ ಶಾಖ ಕಟ ಆರ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಶಾಖ ವೇರ್ ಕಟೋಪನಿಷತ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ ದಟ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಶಾಖ ವೇದ ಶಾಖ ಯಜುರ್ವೇದಿಯ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಯಜುರ್ವೇದ ಶಾಖ ಡಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಇಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದೋಸ್ ಕರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಏಕ ಗ್ರಂಥ ಪಠಿತ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ದಿ ಕಾಠಕ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಸಿಂಗಲ್ ಗ್ರಂಥ ಸಿಂಗಲ್ ಶಾಖ ಇನ್ ದೋಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಎವರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟೆಡ್ ರೆಡ್ ಪಠಿತ ಚಾಂಟೆಡ್ ಸಚ್ ಆಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಪ್ರವೃತ್ತಿ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಎಟ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ದೇ ಆರ್ ವೆರಿ ಪ್ರಸಿದ್ಧ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪ್ರಸಿದ್ಧ ಆಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಭೇದ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಇಸ್ ಡಿಫ್ರೆಂಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಅದರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಕಟಶ್ರುತಿ ಸೊ ದೇ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪ್ರಸಿದ್ಧ ಭೇದ ಸೊ ದೋಸ್ ವಿಚ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪ್ರಸಿದ್ಧ ಭೇದ ಇನ್ ಕಟಶ್ರುತಿ ಸಚ್ ಆಸ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಎಟ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಡಿಫರ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಅದರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಅದರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಡಿಫರ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ದಿ ಅದರ್ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಡಿಫರೆಂಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಈಚ್ ಅದರ್ ಅಗ್ನಿಹೋತ್ರ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಆಸ್ ದರ್ಶಪೂರ್ಣಮಾಸ ದರ್ಶಪೂರ್ಣಮಾಸ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಆಸ್ ಸೋಮಯಾಗ ಸೋಮಯಗ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದಿ ಸೇಮ್ ಆಸ್ ಪಶುಬಂಧ ಸೊ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಕರ್ಮಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಬಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಲ್ಡ್ ಆಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಕಾಠಕ ಕರ್ಮ ದೇ
विद्या विच हेज बीन टॉट नाचिकेत विद्या ही कॉल्स इट एज नाचिकेत अग्नि नाचिकेत विद्या इट सेल्फ इन द उपनिषद इट सेल्फ वी कॉल्स इट दैट मैन इन मीनिंग द ब्लेसिंग इज गिवन एंड इमीडिएटली इट इज सर्टिफाइड ऑल्सो द संज्ञा इज चेंज ऑलरेडी चेंज now that sanya to the nachiketa agni which is given that is also having kataka katakatva sanya why because it is kataka ek grantha patita it is chanted in the same kata shruti just because have it has the same sanya the nachiketa agni is also kataka agni hotra is also kataka darsha purna masa kataka all these having kataka name does not make all the karma same similarly here just because the san sanya is same does not make the upasana same udghita can be the sanya given to two upasanas which are separate in two separate shakhas and still they can remain separate just like a single katha shakha antargata not even in different shakhas in the same shakha the same sanya need not mean same karma therefore upasana across two different shakhas having the same name does cannot necessarily make the upasana same we have to look at swarupa of the upasana dravya ityadi no the sama uh, the samakhya or sanya is not the only pramana there prakarana bheda will also be have to look at swarupa bheda will also have to be looked at just nama aikya is not sufficient <coughs> this is the vritti for eighth sutra this completes the adhikarana the next adhikarana fourth adhikarana here is vyapti adhikarana <coughs> where omkara is vyapta is vyapta meaning omkara is there across the shruti across shakhas across vedas across entire set of shakhas of all vedas omkara pervades because omkara is the name of parmatma and not only is omkara chanted before each mantra which may not be there in uh, during the karma it is chanted but it may not be there in the in print etc but still omkara finds itself in various upasanas various karmas also meaning karmaanga upasanas independent upasanas also so omkara is there through and through the vedas through and through the shakhas now what puro pakshi says that with this understanding puro pakshi says purvam om iti etad aksharam udgitham or this understanding is there uh, which siddhanti brings out that omkara is there all over therefore a specific omkara is discussed in udgita what puro pakshi is saying is that purvam om ityetar aksharam udgitham ityatra omkara udgitayoho visheshana visheshya bhavam siddhavat krutya prakrama bheda vidya bheda siddhantitah what has been done in the earlier adhikarana by the siddhanti puro pakshi says that visheshana visheshya bhava has been shown between omkara and udgita <coughs> omkara is visheshya and udghita is visheshana which omkara udghita antargata omkara udghita is a particular sama we have seen pancha bhaktika sapta bhaktika ityadi sapta bhaktika so udghita which is there in the third place in pancha bhaktika sama or fourth place in the sapta bhaktika sapta bhaktika sama that udghita has omkara so which omkara only that omkara which is there in udghita is being discussed in the upasana <coughs> that is what makes the upasana as udghita upasana just give me a moment please i have a little throat uh, irritation <coughs> sorry <coughs> सो ओंकार उदीत विशेषण विशेष भाव भाव सिद्धवत् 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 निश्चय निश्चय कृत्व निश्चय 
कृत्वा सिद्धवत कृत्य निश्चय कृत्वा हैविंग एसरटेन्ड एस टू वॉट इज दिस ओंकार रिलेशन विथ उदीत देर इज अ विशेषण विशेष भाव संबंध बिकॉज वॉट हेज बीन सेड ओम इतिदर उदीत ओम इज दिस पर्टिक्युलर अक्षर उदीत सो यू सी सामनाधिकरण्यम इज देर सो वॉट कैंड ऑफ सामनाधिकरण्यम सामनाधिकरण्यम आर सी न फोर टाइप्स वील सी मोर इन दी वृत्ति आर जस्ट एक्सप्लेन इट एंड देन दी वृत्ति विल बी ईजियर फास्टर सो देर आर फोर टाइप्स ऑफ सामनाधिकरण्य वन इज ऐक्य सामनाधिकरण ऐक्य मीनिंग वॉट इट इज वन एंड दि सेम सो फॉर एक्सापल यू हैव विल टेक सिंपल एक्सापल्स विच आर वेल नोन सो तत्वसी तत्वसी इज ऐक्य सामनाधिकरण तत् एंड तम हैव सामनाधिकरण बट दे आर ऐक्य सामना मीनिंग तत् एंड तम देर इज नो डिफरेन्स बिटवीन दी टू एट ऑल दैट इज ए सामनाधिकरण सो ऐक्य सेकेंड इज वॉट इट इज अध्यास अध्यास इज सामनाधिकरण सो वॉट इज दध्यास अध्यास इज वी सॉ एन एक्सापल लास्ट टाइम एज टू अध्यास इज रज्जु बींग सीन एज सर्पा वी हेव सीन दिस एक्सापल बट इन कर्मकांड इन उपासना एक्सेट्रा वॉट यू डू यू हैव विष्णु बुद्धि इन सालिग्राम यू हेव इन सालिग्राम विष्णु बुद्धि और इन शिवलिंगा वी हेव शिव बुद्धि इट इज एन अध्यास बट इट इज एन अध्यास विच इज टॉट बाय दि श्रुति रिवील्ड बाय दि श्रुति एंड इट इज अ विधि वाक्य विधि वाक्य जन्य अध्यास और विधि वाक्य कृत अध्यास देर फोर इट इज एन अध्यास सामनाधिकरण इट इज उपासना यू नो दैट अध्यस्थ शिवलिंग बुद्धि इज अध्यस्थ शिव बुद्धि इज अध्यस्थ इन इन दि लिंग स्टोर एंड विष्णु बुद्धि इज अध्यस्थ ऑन दि सालग्रम स्टोन सो इट इज एन अध्यास सामनाधिकरण द स्टोन इज नॉट शिवा शिवा इज नॉट स्टोन बट यू सी Shiva in the stone Shivalinga, in the murti, in the murti also having that buddhi. So all that is what that is adhyasa samana dikarani. Then there is visheshana visheshana bhava. What is visheshana visheshana bhava? Or uh, before that we will see as there there is the third one which is refuted, which is not considered here as uh, the meaning. Visheshana visheshana bhava is a conclusion. So conclusion uh, the fourth samana dikar visheshana visheshana bhava we will see the fourth. As the fourth, the third, which is negated as not the samana dikrana, here is what it is. Um, apavada samana dikrana. Apavada samana dikrana is also known as uh, is also known as um, what uh, it is. Uh, it is called as uh, like uh, sarvam khalvidam brahma. It is uh, badhayam samana dikrana. और बाधेन सामनाधिकरण एज अमास इट इज कॉल्ड बाध सामनाधिकरण सो सर्व खल विद ब्रह्म वॉट इज इट मीन सर्व एंड ब्रह्म हैव सामनाधिकरण दे आर वन एंड दि सेम आर दे नो दे आर नॉट बिकॉज प्रपंच सर्व इज प्रपंच दैट प्रपंच इज ब्रह्म वेन यू से देन वॉट इट मीन्स इज दैट प्रपंच बाधा टेक्स प्लेस एंड देन देर इज सामनाधिकरण आफ्टर बाधा सो बाधायाम सत्याम सामनाधिकरण बाध सामनाधिकरण सर्व नास्ति ब्रह्म एव अस्ति मीनिंग इज व्हाट सर्व नास्ति ब्रह्म एव अस्ति देर इज नथिंग कॉल्ड एज प्रपंच इंडिपेंडेंटली एक्सिस्टेंट ओनली ब्रह्म इज अपियरिंग इन दैट मैनर देर फोर प्रपंच विच इज नाम रूपात्मक इज नॉट ब्रह्म लिटरली व्हेन नाम रूप इज निगेटेड सब्लेटेड दैट नाम इज मिथ्या नाम डज नॉट हैव रियल एक्सिस्टेंस रूप इज मिथ्या रूप डज नॉट हैव रियल एक्सिस्टेंस वॉट रिमेन्स इज शुद्ध ब्रह्म देर फोर देर इज सामनाधिकरण सो बाध सामनाधिकरण लाइक अनदर एक्सापल शास्त्रीय एक्सापल इज वॉट दि दि स्तंभ दट यू सी स्तंभ स्तंभपुरुष सो स्थाणुरव पुरुष विन स्थाणुरव पुरुष दैट इज दि बाध सामनाधिकरण दि इन अ डिम्लिट एरिया वेर यू नो दैट देर आर यू नो देर हैव बीन केसेस ऑफ रॉबरी एक्सेट्रा If you are all alone and you are walking and you see from a distance, you see a small dried tree stump, which is of the height of a human being. You cannot be certain as a whether it is a tree or as a or a human being. So, stanu stanu 
चोरह चौरह सो वन मे थिंक दैट फ्रॉम दी फ्रॉम अ डिस्टेंस और यू कैन से नॉट अ ग्रेट डिस्टेंस ऑल्सो यू आर वॉकिंग एंड फ्रॉम द कॉर्नर ऑफ योर आई यू सी अ शेडो बिकॉज सम ऑफ द लाइटिंग हैज अ लिटिल बिट डिम लिट लाइटिंग हैज चेंज एंड फॉर सम रीजन देर इज अ चेंज ऑफ शेडो ऑफ द ट्री सो द शेडो चेंजेस एंड फ्रॉम द कॉर्नर ऑफ योर आई यू सी एज दो द ट्री हैज मूड देर इज अ भाना लाइक दैट भ्रमा लाइक दैट द ट्री हैज मूड सो you think that oh uh, a thief is there or so you be a little careful there but if you look at it so you turn your torch around and point it at the tree or point it at the chora you think that it is a thief there you see it is not a thief at all it is just a stump of a tree or a lamp post or something like that you know so what is that that samana rikaran means stanu reva chora so chora ha nasti stanu reva asti if you look at it you cannot see the The thief and the stanu are one as aikya samana di karana or vishesha na vishesha bhava. You have to say it is badha. There is no sambandha between the two in the sense that the thief is also there and the stanu is also there and the stanu itself is the literally it is not the thief and the thief is not literally a stump stump of the tree. Then what kind of samana di karana? It is badha am samana di karana. There is no thief at all. There is no thief at all. There is only the stump of the tree. That is the samana dikran. So what you saw by mistake as thief, that thief is not there at all. It is just the stump of the tree. In Raju Sir Paul, so you can see it in that manner. So this is the uh, example as to the third type of samana dikran. The fourth samana dikran is visheshana visheshya bhava, as in viraha ramaha gachchati. So Viraha Ramaha Vanam Gachchati. So Viraha and Rama have Samana Dikrani. What is the Samana Dikrani there? To differentiate from other other people who have Rama name, we say that this Rama is Ayodhya Pati Ramaha or Viraha Ramaha. So Viraha Rama is differentiated from some other Rama who is not Vira. So Visheshana is used to differentiate one from the other. For example, Nilotpalam, Utpala, Rakta Utpala, Nilotpala. So what kind of a lily or a lotus? so which so a red colored or a blue colored lily so you are differentiating the lily by saying nilotpalam the utpala lily is nila is blue so that blue lotus what is the samana the blueness that blue and lotus or the lily it is one and the same entity but visheshana is being added because the meaning of blue word does not mean lotus or lily and the meaning of lily is not blue so what kind of a lily if your question is there which lily should i bring somebody says bring me lily which kind of lily so which colored lily blue lily not red lily so this this is the visheshana visheshya bhava sambandha and thereby samana adhikarane so purvam om iti etad aksharam udgitam ichitra omkara udgita visheshana visheshya bhavam siddhavat krutya As an axiom or as an ischaya, Siddhanti has taken that out of the four samana dikranams, he has already assumed that is the fourth type, visheshana visheshya bhava. He, so Siddhanti is saying that Om is a visheshya, and which kind of Om kara? It is udgita antargata Om kara. So udgita becomes the visheshana to this Om kara. It's an adjective. सिद्धवत कृत्य प्रक्रम भेदा विद्या भेदा एंड देन देर वाई यू सेट दैट देर इज अ प्रकरण भेदा प्रक्रम इज प्रकरण प्रकरण भेदा इज देर एंड देर फोर वॉट देर इज विद्या भेदा उपासन भेदा बिटवीन दी टू शाखा दिस इज वॉट हैज बीन दि सिद्धांत सिद्धांति दिस हेज बीन एस्टाब्लिश बाय दि सिद्धांति सन युक्त आक्षेप संगत नम पूर्वपक्षी से दट दिस इज नॉट अ वैलिड एनालिसि इट इज नॉट दैट देर इज अ विशेषण विशेष भाव You cannot be certain that this is this is the assessment, and you cannot ascertain so. Says the Puro Pakshi, and thereby vyaptya di karanam comes up. Vyaptesh cha samanjasam, vyaptesh cha samanjasam. Says Bhagwan Sutra Kara. Vyapte he cha because of Omkara sya vyapte he because Omkara is vyapta through and through the Vedas, through and through the shakhas of all Vedas. Therefore. समंजसम व्याप्ते है च समंजसम व्हाट समंजसम ओमकार से वेदेशु व्याप्तत्वात व्याप्ते है च मींस व्हाट एंड ड्यू टू ओमकार बीइंग 
all pervasive in upanishads uh, not upanishads in all shakas of all vedas therefore what visheshana vishesha bhava samanadikaranam samanjasam the only possibility nischaya possible as to what kind of samanadikaranam between omkara and udgita it is visheshana visheshya bhava how so vritti will take all four options and then see which is applicable here इन सामनाधिकरण अत्र पूर्व पक्षे पूर्वोक्त सिद्धांत असिद्धि ही सिद्धांते तत्सिद्धि रे जी फल भेदा पूर्व पक्षी सेज दैट देर इज नो विशेषण विशेष्य भाव एस्टैब्लिश्ड सो इट इज असिद्ध एंड सिद्धांती सेज दैट इट इज सिद्ध वी हैव ऑलरेडी एस्टैब्लिश्ड इट इफ यू हैव अ डाउट वी विल क्लियर द डाउट्स सो विशेषण विशेष्य भाव सामनाधिकरण बिटवीन ओंकार एंड उद्गीता इज डेफिनेटली अ कंक्लूसिव थिंग देयर कैन नॉट बी एनी डाउट रिगार्डिंग दैट हाउ सो अत्र ओम अक्षर उद्गीत ओंकार उद्गीत शब्द सामनाधिकरण श्रूयते सो सामनाधिकरण इज रूट इन शब्द अर्थाज आर डिफरेंट सो ब्लू मीन समथिंग एल्स उद्गीत मीन समथिंग एल्स एंड लिली मीन समथिंग एल्स जस्ट लाइक ओंकार मीन समथिंग एल्स अदर देन उद्गीत सो देर कैन बी ब्लू वॉल ब्लू टेबल ऑल्सो सो ब्लू डज नॉट हैव दी मीनिंग ऑफ लिली Similarly, Udgita is a Sama mantra. That itself is not Omkara. Omkara has a different meaning. Udgita has a different meaning. But there is Samana de Karan made there. So Arthas are different, but Shabdas have Samana de Karan. Meaning, meaning of the words are different. They have different meanings in different scenarios. But in this particular scenario, they point towards a single adhikarana. That samanam adhikaranam yayo ho, yayo ho, padayo ho, samanam adhikaranam meaning artha ha, yayo ho, padayo ho, te samana adhikarane. Those te pade, those padas are what they are called as samana adhikarana padas. And between them, what is the bhava? Tasse bhava ha. Is what saman adi karanyam by shenj pratya. So saman, so saman adi karanyam between two padas. Here between udgita shabda, pada is shabda, and omkara is shabda. So between omkara and udgita shabda, there is saman adi karanyam by the mantra om itye taraksham udghitam. So there by saman adi karanyam shruyate tayo ho pada yo ho shabda yo ho. Tatkim nama Brahma iti vata adhyasartham uta. यद रजतम सा शुक्ति इतिवत अपवादार्थम आहोस्वित सिंधुरक्करी वत ऐक्य प्रमीतर्थम उत आहो नीलोत्पलम वत विशेषण विशेष भाव निबंधनम संशय वॉट इज ए डाउट नाउ वॉट कैंड ऑफ सामनाधिकरण औट ऑफ दि फोर विच वन विच आर दि फोर तत्किम नाव ब्रह्म इतिवत अध्यासार्थम इन उपासना हैव अ ब्रह्म बुद्धि इन समथिंग पर ब्रह्म बुद्धि इन समथिंग सो दैट इज अध्यास जस्ट लाइक विष्णु बुद्धि इन सालग्राम इत्यादि उत अदरवाइज वॉट यद रजतम सा शुक्ति वत अपवादार्थम दैट विच इज सिल्वर दैट इट सेल्फ इज शुक्ति वॉट यू आर सीइंग एज सिल्वर इट इज शेल नथिंग बट शेल सो सिल्वर इज नॉट देर अपवाद हेज टू बी डन इफ सिल्वर इज देर देन शेल एंड सिल्वर आर नॉट सेम बट दैट विच इज शेल दैट इट सेल्फ इज सिल्वर सो यद रजतम दैट विच यू आर सीइंग और आर राइट नाउ सीइंग एज सिल्वर On the beach, you see that is silver from a distance. That is nothing but shell. What does it mean? It means that there is no silver at all. There is only shell. But samanadi karan is there. It is what apavada artham. Apavada. Apavada is what it is. Bad samanadi karan. Unless there is bad of rajata, you cannot say it is shukti. Unless there is bad of prapancha, you cannot say it is brahma. Brahma should be established only by bad of prapancha. Appears as prapancha, but nama rupa is not there in Brahma. Therefore, it is apavadartham. Aus with a sindura kari iti vata. Sindura is a name to the uh, aikya pramityartham. So sindura, it has the same meaning there. Kari is kara is hand, and kari is an elephant. So the trunk is called as an additional hand as though because the elephant uses the trunk as a hand. it picks up and eats using the trunk so whatever one does with a hand the 
elephant does with its trunk so therefore the trunk is called as the kara as though a kara so here um, kari sindhura sindhura is also an elephant there is it's an elephant so what kind of samana adikram there that is aikya pramityartam so eka prama when you say sindhura or you say kari it has the same meaning there <coughs> thereby what is the samana adikram there aikya so three are what one is adhyasartha other is apavadartha or bada samana adikram third is aikya pramityartam which one is your om iti etad aksharam udgitam the fourth is uh, what uta aho ya yeah, fourth is remain nilotpalam iti so nilotpalam we have seen a blue lily iti vat visheshana visheshya bhava nibandanam iti so it is visheshana visheshya bhava is the karana for the samana adikaranam nila is the visheshana and utpala is the visheshya iti samshay when such a doubt comes nirdharane karana bhavad anirdharita arthakam iti purva paksha this uh, this is a typo here there are no two me there is only one me there so karana bhavat anirdharartak anirdharitartakam iti purva paksha anirdharita you cannot have nirdhara at all you cannot ascertain that this is the meaning why because there is absolutely nothing to allow you to make nischaya says the purva pakshi why he says nirdharane karana bhava there is no karana available to make a nirdhara this is the meaning what how will you make a nischaya you cannot categorize into any of these four at all certainly you, with with ascertainment idam itham definitely it is in this category it can be in any of the four categories so there is confusion you have absolutely no solution here says the purva pakshi सो इति पूर्व पक्ष सिद्धांत सिद्धांत से ओंकार से ऋग्यजु सामसु त्रिषु व्याप्ते व्याप्त कह ओंकार उपास्य अपेक्षायां उद्गीत अवयवत्व ओंकार विशेष्य सिद्धांति से इट इज पॉसिबल टू एनलाइज एंड कंक्लूड एज वेल राइटली एज विशेषण विशेष भाव हाउ सो बिकॉज ओंकार इज देर इन ऋग्यजु साम ऑल दि वेद अथर्व वेद डज नॉट हैव इट्स ओन पर्टिकुलर मंत्रा दे आर दि सेम ऋग्यजू और साम मंत्रा सो वेदाज आर सेट टू बी फोर और दे आर काउंटेड एज थ्री ऑल्सो वेन यू से थ्री अथर्व इज इंक्लूडेड वाय अथर्व वेद इज इंक्लूड बिकॉज अथर्व वेद हैज ऋग मंत्रा यजुर् मंत्रा और साम मंत्रा अथर्व इज ए नेम ऑफ द ऋषि ऋग्यजुस एंड साम आर पर्टिकुलर टाइप्स ऑफ मंत्रा दे आर नॉट ऋषिज नेम्स अथर्व इज ए नेम ऑफ द ऋषि so rig is a type of a mantra yajur is a type of a mantra sama is a type of a mantra which is sang so yajur mantras are used to while making offerings and rig mantra is basically it is chanted it need need not necessarily have a connection with a yaga this is a general uh, differentiation not uh, completely accurate so to say but rig is a name of a mantra yajur is also name of mantra and sama is the name of a mantra whereas atharva veda has mantras which are from all these three types they are all three types of mantras of rukyajur and sama and all these three find place in the veda mantras which are seen by atharva rishi therefore atharva veda gets its name from the rishi there is no separate type of mantra there now so uh, what it means is that all four vedas are included all shakhas are included in all shakhas omkara is trishu vyapte so they are there in all the three vedas all the shakhas of the three vedas omkara is vyapta and therefore what because of that reason vyaptatvat hetu ho kah omkara upase vich omkara is to be meditated upon in this upasana when this query comes up when this doubt comes up this akanksha comes up देन अपेक्षायां उद्गीत अवयवत्व ओंकार विशेष्य दिस ओंकार विच इज टू बी मेडिटेटेड अपॉन इज दैट ओंकार विच इज इन दि उद्गीत ऑफ दि साम साम मंत्र सो उद्गीत विच इज अ पार्ट ऑफ उद्गीत उद्गीत अवयवत्व अवयव इज अ पार्ट ऑफ वॉट उद्गीत उद्गीत इज अ साम मंत्र सो दैट पर्टिक्युलर ओंकार विच फाइंड्स इट्स इन दि साम मंत्र 
called as Udgita, that is one which qualifies this Omkara, therefore Visheshyate. And thereby you can separate out particular Omkara from so many Omkaras across so many mantras in so many Shakas of so many Vedas. Thereby Omiti Etadaksharam Udgita Upasita iti means what? Visheshana Visheshya Bhava Samanadi Karanyam. That particular Omkara is Upasya which is in the Udgita. Evancha Udgitam iti Omkarasya Visheshanam ityeva Samanjasam Niravadyam. So doubtlessly analysis is faultless as to Udgitam iti Omkarasya Visheshanam. Udgita is the Visheshana to the Omkara which is Visheshya. That is Niravadyam, faultless samanjasam, it is valid. It is a valid analysis that we have done and we have concluded well. You do not know how we have concluded, therefore you have a doubt, we will explain. And then Cha Shabda is there in the Sutra. Sautra Cha Shabdena Tu Shabda Sthana Niveshina Adhyasa Apavada Aikya Pakshana Mirasaha. The other three Samanadikarnam possibilities are refuted by the Cha Shabda which has the meaning of Tu. So Cha has also the meaning of Tu. So it is not, it is to refute the three possibilities of Samana Dikranam as to what Adhyasa, Apavada or Aikya. They are not Adhyasa, the, the, not they, the Om and Udgita do not have Adhyasa kind of Samana Dikranam, Apavada kind of Samana Dikranam or Aikya kind of Samana Dikranam. Why? That is refuted by Tu Shabda, Arthika, Cha Shabda. So Cha Shabda which has the meaning of Tu Shabda. Tu Shabda Sthana Niveshina. It has the, it has the Sthana of Tu Shabda meaning has the, carries the meaning of Tu Shabda. By such Nivesha, by using that meaning, pointing out that other three possibilities are not there, you land on Samanjasam as to the fourth one being the only possible Samanadikaranyam between Omkar and Udgita. This is just a statement. It has not been explained, says the Purva Pakshi, to that Siddhanti answers not our Adhyasa Paksha. This Adhyasa Paksha is not possible. Why? Samana Adhikaran between Udgita and Om are not of the type of Adhyasa. Why? Tasya Uttaratra Vidyamana Upasya. Uh, there is a typo here. Upasya Paksha. Uh, upas, there is a Takara missing between Sakara and Yakara. Vidyamana Upasya Paikshaya. Upasya Apekshaya. Sandhi will be Upastya Pekshaya. So Vidhyamana Upastya Pekshaya. What is being said is that Uttarat later what has been said? Upasti. This Om Ta Natavad Adhyasa Pakshavai Tasya Uttaratra Vidhyamana Upastya Pekshaya. Swatantra Upastitvena Prusak Phala Kalpana Prasangat. If you say that this is Adhyasa, then later there is a Vidhi given. As what? It is Upasti. This Udgita Omkara is Upasti. So when the Vidhi is given as to it is Upasti, you, the Upasana is to be done as this as Upasti, then if you do a Adhyasa Kalpana further, then you have to do a separate Phala Kalpana also. If you have done an Adhyasa, then for Adhyasa there has to be a Phala. Why should you do an Adhyasa? So Adhyasa is one interpretation that you have already done earlier between these and later mantra is going to say no this is how the upasti is the upasana is in this manner so when the upasana swarupa is being explained that has a particular phala and in this mantra omiti etar aksharam udghitam here you see adhyasa if you say adhyasa samana adhikranam then what is the phala because omiti etar aksharam udghitam is an adhyasa given by this particular vakya and later Vakya gives an Upasana Swarupa. So there is a difference between the two. If there is a difference between the two, here you have done Adhyasa, there there is an Upasana. Then here what is the Phala? You will have to make another Kalpana. What is that Kalpana? Swatantra Upasthitvena Prutak Kalpana Prutak Phala Kalpana Prasangat. There is a Swatantra Upasana which is going to come up earlier. Here you have done Adhyasa. So compared to uh, Vidyamana Upasya Pekshaya Swatantra Upasthitvena Prutak Kalpana Prasangat. You have to do a Kalpana of another Phala separate from the Upasana which is being ordained later. Here Omiti Etar Aksharam Udgitam 
if you don't see ekavakyata between them here you have taken the adhyasa meaning there there is an upasa upasti meaning so upasti meaning has one phala now you have to give another phala with adhyasta meaning thereby to another phala has to be imagined by you that is a flaw in mimamsa visheshana pakshe tu na prathak phala kalpana prasanga in visheshana there is no prathak kalpana why what is udgita that itself is omkara this is how the upasana will be taught and what you are saying this is a particular upasana which uh, particular omkara qualified by udgita being in the udgita so so udgita antargata omkara is upasti there is an upasana swarupa taught later regarding this particular omkara only therefore there is no separate phala kalpana needed there is eka vakyata what about the second possibility apavada paksha ना अभी अपवाद पक्ष अपवाद इज ऑलसो नॉट पॉसिबल वाय ओंकार उदीत अतर ज्ञान से बाधक अदर्शना बिकॉज इफ यू नो ओंकार एंड यू नो उदीत अंतर्गत ओंकार यू नो उदीत एज साम मंत्र विच हेज ओंकार इफ यू ऑलरेडी न्यू ओंकार एंड देन यू नो दिस मंत्र वेर उदीत मंत्र साम मंत्र उदीत हेज ओंकार does it take away your understanding of omkara it doesn't let's say you did not know omkara and you learned omkara after the udgita mantra so udgita mantra is understood and then there is an om chanting there you learned omkara separately also has having different meanings does not take away this omkara of the udgita at all or the udgita sama is not negated by omkara so omkara and udgita do not have apavada kind of understanding at all meaning one does not negate the other at all both both ways just like sthanu is equal to chauraha if you say chaura and sthanu cannot be the meaning of the same entity either it is sthanu or it is chauraha so there is apavada one negates the other both ways one who is a thief cannot be the stump of the tree and the stump of the tree is jada it cannot be the sentient thief there is definite opposition between the two so apavada has to be done but that kind of apavada is not there there is no badaka badaka bhava is not there badakatva is not there if you know omkara and you know sama antargata udgita there is no opposition between them at all there is no badha of omkara by udgita and there is no bad of udgita by omkara therefore badakatva adarshana that apavada paksha is also not valid what about the third possibility na api aikya paksha o udgita is omkara omkara is udgita can you say that you cannot why omkara udgita yo paryayatva abhavat there is no such meaning paryaya meaning there is no synonym Syn- Udgita is not synonymous to Omkara. Omkara is not synonymous to Udgita because Udgita is a particular Sama. In the Sama mantra, the third or the fourth is Udgita. That particular segment of mantra is Udgita, and that is not Omkara. Similarly, Omkara does not mean Udgita. Both ways there is no Aikya Pariyatva Abhava. They are not synonyms of each other. Atah. Out of the four, three have been shown as impossible. If three are impossible, parishesha nayaya, parisheshaad, visheshana paksha yev shreya nidhi siddham. Therefore, only what is left is the fourth paksha. Three have been shown as impossible. If three are impossible, what is remaining has to be the only possibility, and that we have already established as how it is separating omkara by qualifying it as an udhita antargata omkara. therefore that is the valid meaning shreyan visheshana paksha is the only one remaining it is the only one which makes sense therefore it is the the best of the four is omkara nothing else fits only this meaning will fit and thereby visheshana visheshya bhava paksha is the only possible further uh, it is siddham Uh, so yeah in the uh, uh, the next adhikarana we'll go to in the next part ha huh? we'll stop here the adhikarana is over uh, i would like to go to the next class a little uh, sensibly this time okay so uh, 
there is a question udgita i'll cover this in the next part there is a uh, udgita is gana there is a gana udgita is a technical name uh, so now it's so there is a question what is udgita and udgita uh, udgita the thakar and takara so udgita is a gana their gana and udgita is a technical name for the sama there so that is the difference there uh, so udgita is a the uh, what has been said if you look at it udgita udgita the mantra has udgitam upasita udgita is a technical name for the sama and udgita has come up where is udgita ha uh, udgaya so there udgaya is to so sing that so when it is a udgita is singing of the udgita and udgaya means you sing the udgita so udgita karta so udgayata this, this is this gana gana is shown when singing of udgita is done because sama is sung so udgita is the technical name of that pancha bhakti pancha bhakti ka or sapta bhakti ka sama that is the technical name and the gana will be called as when it is sung it is called udgita the geeta gana so that is the difference there so so udgita is which is udgita meaning what is sung udgita when it is sung it is called as udgita udgana etc okay thank you very much okay so that is the uh, that is my understanding at least so here udgita karta will be udgata so that's how uh, the hmm. name is given so uh, udgita with thakara what is there that is the technical name of the uh, particular sama okay udgita rakshu or omiti taksharam so i am actually chanting the mantra itself but it is the amna yanta samsiddham adi madhyanta varjitam anandagana mahapurnam atma jyoti rupasmehe namaste dhanyavada dhanyavada